Same exact smell, but when I pull these out, I'm gonna do the slow, you know, unreal, un uh, reveal. Sheesh. Dang, this pair is definitely crazy. When I saw mock-ups of it, like I was like, nah, it's definitely a pass. But nah, these are crazy. Definitely fire. Hey man, say man, it's Young Too Real in the cut on the mic. As you can see, back at it again with another fire review video. And today I got some heat, literally some heat. As you can see by the title, I got the trophy rooms. I got two pairs because um, you know, some secret sauce. But yeah, I got two pairs. Um, one in 12 and a half, my size, and one um in like a size seven. So not my size, but um, yeah. As you can see, two trophy room bags. I had to go pick these up from trophy room, like the store in Orlando. So um, yeah. Drop a like for this video, drop a sub, all that good stuff. And uh, we're just gonna get right into it. You know what I'm saying? I did drop like um, a little short that kind of went crazy of like someone offering me right when I walked out of the store like $1,100 just for these two pairs that I low key should have took, but it's all good. You know what I'm saying? You live and you learn, but hey, we don't get around this review. Let's get it. I'm gonna look at the 12.5. I'm probably just gonna keep the seven in the box. Um, it has a really cool box though. So um, yeah, um, yeah, super dope box. Look at the box, as you can see like kind of like a faded look definitely fire definitely looks like some limited stuff got that tri that trophy room logo in the top right corner um official edition nike says i thought that special edition but it says official edition but yeah i'm gonna open it up see how it looks as you can see 12.5 but they had a lot of pairs in the store man i'm not gonna lie like they had like dozens of pairs like probably hundreds in the back so yeah they had a lot of pairs going on so i should have expected the prices to drop but they were really high at the time whenever i picked them up but anyways um, when you open up the box, you see like the Orlando, like the sky, like the city, like line, city scraper. It smells like a bookstore in here. It smells really good. It smells like a fresh shoe. But um, as you can see, I don't know if that's Orlando. If it has like a cityscape, I don't know if that's Chicago or, or Orlando. One of the two. Hopefully my mic's working, all that good stuff. But um, yeah. Um, the pa the packaging super dope though. It's like and it's like special box, like an orange lobster special box, but like Jordan version. Like looks like some like I don't know, just some dope stuff. As you can see like looks pretty crazy we're gonna open it up take it out of here whatever this is because um i don't plan on towing these i do plan on selling these because like market's still pretty crazy on them it's like sitting at about 600 bucks just on this pair right now so it's still pretty crazy on them um it's still around i'm still gonna get around that whatever um anyways yeah it smells really good though so like a fresh shoe it's kind of hard to get out i mean it's 12.5 so I might just have to flip it upside down it smells like a fresh jordan sheesh it up okay yeah it's like in some sort of box and the bottom has like the signature i don't know what that is probably like a jordan signature but um put this to the side somewhere probably put it right here but yeah as you can see it comes in this like a little like i want to say baseball card but no it's definitely you know like a basketball obviously themed obviously because it's jordan shoe you know what i'm saying obviously but yeah super dope comes like it looks like more special than what it is though it's just like a plastic box with like a cool little wrapping paper inside with the shoes inside as you can see like a like super dope like i don't know i really like this concept this box right here they're dropping on sneakers in two days the 21st so um yeah you know what i'm saying There's, it's gonna be super exclusive i wonder if, what how prices are gonna be afterwards if it's gonna go up if it's gonna go down i don't know how, i don't know you never know because people are probably gonna take some l's and the prices might skyrocket you never know or it might be you know might go down 50 bucks 100 bucks you never know or like i said hopefully it skyrockets because i still got a pair two pairs so yeah i'm opening them up i have not seen these in person yet so let's get right into them open it up like it's like in the good all right y'all um got it open i'm gonna try to you know keep these oh my gosh that smell oh my that's what bro jordan ones always they have that notorious smell i remember when like the breads came out like 2016 like they have the same exact smell but when i pull these out i'm gonna do the slow you know unreal un uh, reveal sheesh dang this pair is definitely crazy when i saw mock-ups of it like i was like nah that's definitely a pass but nah these are crazy definitely fire oh my man these are clean honestly i wouldn't tow them because they're not completely my style but super dope that like red patent on the front the patent breads dropped and they brick but these had some hype behind them and they went crazy let's just say the, let's say the least you know what i'm saying but yeah smells fire smells like a jordan one has that signature like logo i don't know if that's jordan or like trophy room yeah i think that's jordan's logo signature logo right there on like the back right i'm gonna put this box back in here or oh, actually there's another pair in there hold up um yeah the insoles like a lime green with that trophy room logo pretty sure the the both insoles are like different color 
so that's really dope definitely a fire shoe has a trophy room logo right there i don't know if i sewed that right there like on the side the back has this like gold embroidered like jordan thing super dope it's like metal i'm pretty sure yeah definitely metal i'm not gonna scuff that and the back kind of looks like carbon fiberly like carbon fibery almost but it's like a suede back you know pretty dope definitely a dope shoe definitely would stand out when you wear it because i mean these were pretty exclusive they only dropped hold on excuse me <laughs> excuse me they only dropped the, like i said in the store the trophy room store in orlando and they're dropping this um the 21st on sneakers app so yeah very exclusive like you had to be in the florida area just to get these so yeah definitely a dope shoe like it kind of you know went crazy it's kind of like the only shoe right now it's been dropping that's been hype so it's kind of been stealing the show but yeah there's there's some dope drops coming up that are going to probably be better but uh, yeah some travises and stuff but these are super dope then nike swoosh definitely super quality like super thick that nike swoosh but yeah these are definitely gonna get sold definitely not gonna keep them for the toe because like honestly i'm not too crazy about them and for the price they are right now i don't know i just wouldn't see me towing them but yeah i did get them for retail though so can't go wrong getting a pair for retail pull out the other pair real quick actually i might just keep the well actually i'll pull it out, pull it out. yeah the other pair comes out comes with like an extra set of laces so the insole is it lime green no the uh, this insole is blue so i was right the insoles are different colored has the extra green laces this insole is blue i'm gonna put this back in there though because you know what i'm saying i'm not trying to you know definitely a dope shoe though definitely fire oh my 12 and a half is huge like this is definitely my size but dang like when you feel 12 and a half it's huge but yeah i got a size 7 too i'm not gonna take the size 7 out because there's no points same exact shoe but definitely fire that suede like that patent um top with like i don't know i really like the color blocking very simple very kind of you know it's very simple but very dope at the same time i'm not gonna lie the hype did get to me a little bit on this pair because like like i said when i saw the mock-ups i was like no nah, i'm definitely gonna drop that pair but i did hear it's gonna be like exclusive so you know i didn't know it's gonna be exclusive i didn't know it's gonna go for some bread and it is but yeah definitely fire um I can't really say jordan one lows are like dead because like i mean every travis scott has been jordan one like every travis scott shoe that's been going for money besides like the new mac attacks or whatever are jordan one low like you know so like what i'm trying to say is like jordan one low is definitely still if, if it's a fire colorway it's a fire collab behind the brand like it's gonna do numbers pretty much but yeah pretty fire i wonder what, how the extra green laces would look on here and like i said i cannot i'm not gonna show you all the on feet unfortunately because you know i'm not trying to tow these you know i'm not really trying to tow an expensive shoe you know what i'm saying just trying to sell it really but yeah definitely fire the bombs red like a bread i brought up the breads how the like in 2016 whenever they like made they redrop like the breads like the 2016 or 17 version like they have the same smell it's crazy jordan ones have the same exact smell but i really like the box on here um honestly it was hard to you know to sell it right away because i wanted to do the review so that's one reason why i didn't sell these right when i you know walked out of the store got a offer that's really the best way to do it though you know just sell it while it's hot but you know it's all good you know what i'm saying it's still pretty hot right now it's still you know still going for some bread so it is what it is though could have got you know a tiny bit more but you know it's cool but yeah definitely fire i really like the nike swoosh how it's super like thick looks quality and it's like it's low-key a daily you can definitely wear this like you know on the daily almost because it's just like super clean it's like that white color blocking anything with like a white color blocking looks clean like i've you those up there and i really like jordan one lows low-key because they look similar to like a dunk and dunks are super popular right now so i don't see why a good jordan one low wouldn't be popular like you know popping right now because this is just a good shoe to wear on the daily you know just jordan one lows in general maybe not the trophy room colorway but jordan one lows in general just are just a clean everyday shoe but i'm gonna put this pair back in the box um try to see if there's any other details that i do not want to miss on this shoe i think i kind of went over everything how the insoles are different color extra laces the back is gold um i want to kind of show y'all close Man, they smell crazy that trophy room logo definitely dope these definitely you know went crazy like the first day these came out like at the trophy room store there was a huge line like i was afraid people were gonna you know take my pair because um i saw like they're like people were going to the back like getting access to how many however many pairs they wanted type stuff so there was some backdoor action going on and um yeah i would believe it on a shoe like this but yeah anyways drop a like drop a sub there's another set of laces in here too i'm pretty sure yeah, I'm pretty sure there's another set of laces, y'all. It comes with two sets of laces, because it might be a green one, might be a blue one. I think it's a blue, oh, it's a white. There's a white set of laces on here, so. Y'all let me know if y'all are towing these, if you have these in the comments. Um, definitely was a hard pair to get, so let me know in the comments if you got this pair, or if you were just, you know, if 
you passed. I mean, if you passed, you probably just couldn't get them, honestly, because who would pass on this shoe? You know, either you want to get it, you know, to, you know, for the toe or, you know, do your thing with it. But anyways, um, yeah, definitely clean. The leather quality is definitely nice on this pair. It's kind of like suede. It's not even like a leather. It is a leather, but it's like suede leather almost. It kind of feels like a suede, the toe box. Definitely fire. Not too much to say. It's definitely kind of like a simpler shoe. Just has that red patent upper and, you know, the white you know the middle with that you know just a good color block and not gonna lie like you could wear it with a red outfit or something but yeah i'm gonna um put these back in the box i'm gonna wrap up this review i think since i'm not gonna do the on feet you know um hold on yeah since i'm not gonna do the on feet unfortunately like i said 100 times um i'm just gonna you know exit off this video so drop a like and sub if you enjoyed this video and you know expect more fire reviews like this got some more fire on the way you know what i'm saying hopefully so let's get it drop a like drop a sub Peace.